Captain Olympic rookie forward Zach Dean uh, joining me here prior to the Sea Dogs in the Olympic tonight. And uh, Zach, maybe we can talk about your your first half. Uh, again, here we are now in January. How how has it gone from your perspective? Uh, yeah, I think my my first half was uh, pretty good. Uh, I mean, coming into the queue, you know that there's definitely uh, an adjustment with uh, speed and, and the size of the game of the players playing against players that are older than you. Uh, but I think I adjusted well, and I think I'm having a pretty good season so far. Big night the other night, first hat trick, mom and dad in the stands. Uh, tell me a little bit about that night and, and how you felt. Uh, yeah, um, it, was, it was a really uh, amazing experience, I guess. When you, you get your first hat trick in the league, it's, it's something special and something that you'll remember for, for a while. Going forward here, uh, January, team's on a roll. Having won 9 of 10 and uh, heading into that, that, that second half. What would you like to accomplish in the second half, both from a team perspective and, and personally? Uh, yeah, like you said, we're, our second half has been pretty good so far. And um, I think uh, for us is to make the playoffs. We're making a push now, only two points out of Halifax. Um, so I think making the playoffs would, would definitely be something uh, for us to uh, accomplish, and I think personally, just keep playing the way I am and, and keep uh, keep going. How different a player are you today, mid-January, than you were when you arrived in, in August? Uh, yeah, like I said, the, the adjustment—it's you're always a bit uh, timid coming in. You, you know, the nerves are there, but I think now I've adjusted really well, and I think uh, that's the biggest part um, when you're first coming in. So, yeah. And uh, your role, uh, the responsibilities, how, how, have they grown as the season's moved on? Yeah, for sure. Uh, after, when you're first coming up, the, the coach has to get trust in you and uh, playing in different situations. And um, I think I've, I've earned his trust in, in playing in some, some better situations, and, and I think that's good. Well, you know, in this first half, he, uh, he, he showed some really good uh, individual uh, flashes. Uh, he's a great kid off the ice, you know, good work ethic. Uh, came in camp, you know, it was really nice. But a uh, 16-year-old with uh, the, quality, the quantity of minutes that he had, I think he uh, he wore down a little bit there, especially after uh, that he went and played with the U17. Uh, I felt that after that he was uh, a lot more tired. He was still playing really good hockey, but uh, didn't put the points that uh, that he wanted. Uh, but coming back from Christmas with a good rest and everything, now he's got the jump, he's got the experience because uh, he had a lot of ice time. So uh, now uh, the whole team is... Uh, is, uh, is happy for him, but at the same time, we're, uh, we're happy for the team that he's up in us win games. Special night the other night, had his first first Q hat trick, mom and dad in the stands. Uh, pretty special night, but what are you expecting from him as you move into the, the second, deeper into the second half of the season? Team's on a bit of a roll, and what, what, what are you hoping he'll, he'll contribute? You know that he keeps uh, you know his confidence high. You know, at the same time, you know, playing a good, uh, good, solid game uh, two ways. You know, it's uh, it's always important here, scoring goals, but also uh, playing the the right way uh, uh, without the puck, and that's uh, that's the biggest challenge a lot of times with the uh, high skilled players. Uh, but uh, you know, he's been uh, doing a really good job with that. So uh, uh, just you know, carry going on and then uh, working hard every day so that he gets better too. Finally, is it too early to tell just how much of an impact the player he will be in this league? Well, you know, with uh, with last game that he's, he's played, he showed great uh, great discipline throughout the game in, uh, in with the game plan, and without uh, cheating, he uh, he managed to to score goals. So then you see that the, the player is aware of uh, of uh, offensive side of the puck, but also the defensive side of the puck. Uh, that's a huge uh, player for uh, any organization to be a you know like a, a difference maker.